every liquid in that truck will burn. Since this mine has started, we've had two haul trucks that have burnt to the ground. Luckily, nobody got hurt in either one of them, but it doesn't take very long to burn them to the ground. It's just amazing how much heat these things produce, and a fire would be the last thing we'd hope to have to deal with. But Alice's truck is on constant fire alert so she doesn't have to be. Under its skin, 330 feet of stainless steel pipes act as life-saving arteries. They connect to tanks of firefighting powder. High-pressure nitrogen canisters are poised to blast the powder to 36 high-precision nozzles sitting in every corner of the truck. It's a giant network of chemical sprinklers that evolved from the world's first automated firefighting system, invented in 1723. The Fire Annihilator. A capsule filled with gunpowder was suspended in a barrel of water and connected to heat-sensitive fuses. Any fire would light the fuses, which would ignite the gunpowder and blast the water onto the flames. 300 years later, the mega truck swaps gunpowder for nitrogen, but it still has fire sensing fuses. Excessive heat triggers a mechanism inside them that shoots the firefighting powder at high pressure to all the truck's potential hot spots. It's a system clever enough to kill almost any fire. I feel like sometimes my baby girl is watching out for me a little bit. I just feel like she's, uh, she's watching my back. Safety protocol calls for regular fire drills across the 30-strong fleet. You take the one tank, you take the second tank. $16,000 worth of fire suppressant powder must be set to shoot in seconds. This is life and death. We need these systems to work properly so these drivers can get out and get back on the ground safely. These trucks can burn very quickly. And you have a lot of heat, a lot of possibility of things catching on fire in the engine compartment. Could be a fire bomb on this thing. This is your main area that if there is going to be a fire, this is where it's going to be to test this truck. You ready, Taylor? Yeah, go ahead. They warm up one of the heat-sensitive fuses to trick the system into thinking there's an engine fire. Driver Doug has just 15 seconds to evacuate. All right, guys, moment of truth. Here we go. Dang, that's a good one. Yeah. That's definitely going to knock fire down on that one. Yeah. No questions asked there. Good right, man. Right there. Good job. job, Taylor. Go. 240 pounds of chemical laying on the ground. Yep. Better there it is. Let's clean that up. <laughs>